Reversing the Badlands in Kazakhstan when Coalition Command made a gutsy call to send troops north, across the Russian border. This was the day I heard about the murderous rioting back home. Deaths in the thousands. People grew tired of the years of bread lines, water shortages, constant blackouts. The blackouts made nights in the cities a swarm of anarchy. Once night fell, you didn't dare leave your house without a death wish. Society had gotten so used to constant electricity that when it failed, the darkness drove people mad. You might think we'd start to adapt, but so far it had just kept getting worse. When I was a kid, there was an old book my grandfather read to me once. It was about some children that went mad when stranded on an island. It said that without a structured society, human beings would return to savagery. Well, it seems that the author was right, because society was crumbling all around us. And that day, in the Kazakhstan Badlands, all the rules of engagement crumbled right along with it. The deserts at the edge of Kazakhstan with the members of the Stray Dog Strike Force. They are, as we speak, advancing north across the Russian border in a move by coalition command that can only be considered as either gutsy. Oh, God! No. Oh, no, God damn it. Incoming! What? Run! What is it? Tactical nukes, God damn it! Cover! Get into the tank! 